We've had tons of things happening at the library. Um, our most recent big news is that we've done a second expansion of our hours. Uh, we first expanded our hours after renovation by uh, adding summer Saturdays in 2018, which we had not previously had. And now as of the beginning of September, we've added eight hours a week to our operating schedule to be open evenings until nine o'clock, four days a week, Monday through Thursday. So that's been really huge for us, really exciting. We know the community's really wanted it. So uh, we've been very pleased to be able to do that. Sure. Well, one of the ones that we had that was um, really amazingly huge is we actually uh, partnered with Friends of Whitehall to bring in someone from the Audubon Society to talk about owls. And she brought three owls with her to the program. And we had, I think, more than 70 people in the room. Um, it was registration only and we had a wait list and it was just a phenomenal program. Everybody from little kids up to seniors were there and people just had a great time. Um, we had a First Amendment program recently, which ran really well. Uh, we've got upstairs right now sign language for infants running, which is always a fun one. We do that a couple times a year. Um, lots of things going on and some things we have coming up. I'm going to try and hit one for every age group. Let's see how good the director's memory is. Um, we have trick-or-treating on Halloween, which we've done every year, and that'll be happening again for the kids throughout the library. They can come to every service point. They can come to the director's office and show off their costumes. Our teen advisory group is running strong and looking for more members. So that's for kids who are in sixth through 12th grades and they want to be a little bit more involved in the library. Right now they're planning to decorate the teen room for the holidays. So that's their big project. Uh, they are meeting next on Monday, November 18th in the afternoon and there's food everybody's welcome uh, we'd love to see more kids there and for adults we have a program coming up on this is the one that I'm gonna forget <laughs> November 12th check our calendar make sure I'm right um, it's called how to speak up about anything and still love yourself so it's really a confidence in speaking and advocating and communicating verbally kind of a workshop it's limited space registration required but we've still got about 10 spots open as of the other day so it would be great if anybody wanted to come to that that's on a tuesday evening that's just a few things <laughs> yeah hopkintonlibrary.org facebook twitter email us walk in we've got signs all over the place the staff are always happy to share what we've got going on too